uh, TV. Here's the, here's the, what do you call that? <laughs> My sweet potato. I still didn't plant it because I just want to find out how it's still growing. Oh my God, look at it, guys. Can you believe that it keep growing? Look at that. Sorry, I have a lot of bread here. My friend just bring a lot of bread. So, look at that. I'm giving that to my neighbor. Because we, can, we don't eat a lot of bread. But look, this is the potato. This is an update. Because it's really growing. I just want to experiment not planting for a week more. Then I'll plant it later to our planters. But, oh my God, guys. Look at this amazing sweet potato. Isn't it amazing? It just grows so, so tall. Maybe I don't know how many... Maybe 10 inches or so, or more. But look at that, it's really huge. Look at that, it really... God, mag magulay na tayo. <laughs> so I just sort of change the everyday, you know? So yeah, look at that, pretty. There you go, bye for now. Just an update, a quick one. Harvesting my uh, kamote tops, or it's like a spinach. So I'm just gonna cut that. Let's see. Gonna be dummy for sure. So I'm just gonna cut the thing that. Oopsie. Again, oh. See, I'm starting to kina in ang dahon ng ano ano. Ano ba rabbit na din naman? Ayan, oh, yung tapos ng kamote. Oh, matigas pag ano yan eh. Ang dami na niya. Oh, so. Ang dami na niya ang tapos. Kasi magawa ako ng gulay today. So is that's what I harvest, but I'm gonna harvest some more. See, there's more right here. Sarap nyan, kataan ko yan with shrimp. Kataan or just hindi kataan, pwede rin hindi siya kataan. Kasi may nagkumain, may ano na, kumain na ng dahon minsan, kaya yung nagustuhan nila, talagos ng kumakay. Meron pa akong ano dyan, tumutubo na yung yellow zucchini ko. Ayan, I'm getting more in here. Just on that one. Nadami pa yan habang hinaharis mo. Nadami pa ito. Just gonna have more. Tapos ng kamote. I like this. I do this every year. I plant this in this area still. I always plant this every year. It's like a spinach. Oops. walang kamote na tumutubo sa ilalim it's fine as long as I have a kamote tops ayan siya minsan kinukuha ko nga lang yung dahon eh. at this way ayan siya ayan oh, sumusuot kasi siya dyan Kasi pag bata pa, bata pa yung leaves niya. That's okay for me. Ito rin din siya. Marami pa dyan. At mayroon pa ako sa harap ng bahay. I plant it in the pot. The one the last time that I put it in, nilagay ko sa paso. Yun ang kukunan ko rin. Kasi malalaki na. Ayan, malaki siya. Ang dami ko nang na-harvest din. Eh. Sa kunting ano lang na nilagay ko, you have more. 
Ayan, magulay tayo mga kaibigan. Magulay tayo ng marami. Lagyan ko to ng shrimp eh. Ito mainit kasi dito sa labas sa, sa, sa backyard ko. Backyard ko ito. Dami rin ko. Pinagpanin ko lang kahit saan saan. Ayan, ano ko na lahat at nakabar ko na lahat yung talbos. At saka yung kinunan ko, dadami din siya. Ayan. Dami din. Ayan, kasi yung kina, yung inano sa Bisaya, pag ikotloan <laughs> Ang tagal ko nang hindi nagamit na word na yan. Pag ikotloan mo siya, tutubo na naman siya. So, the one where you cut them off, doon na naman siya tutubo. Kaya dadami pa yan ang dadami. Sa other side, bago ko lang tinanom last week. Kaya okay lang yun. Ay, ang dami ko nakuha. Isang gulayan na yun. Kasi mag-e-string yan. Kaya isang gulayan na siya. reading ready na talaga siya harvest yan yung mga, yung ano ko yung um, yung raspberry ko ayan ready na yan talaga reading ready na kailangan kong harvest yan today so I just planted it so ayan madami yung raspberry it's all raspberry at thornless so I'm going to harvest so oh my god there's a lot more here right ito sa mga iba na po Guys, remember this, right? Dinala ko dito galing sa likod. I got it from the backyard. This talbos ng kamote. Now, I'm gonna harvest this too because it's so bushy now. So, I'm gonna get the talbos only and left some bottom side so it's gonna grow more. This is the one that I plug. Remember that pot? See? That's the pot that I put. But look at it now. Look how bushy is it now. That's just one potato. That's just the only one potato. But look how bushy it is. Ang tanglad ko, ang laki na siya, oh. Tsaka mayroon pa akong tanglad doon, nandoon, oh. Ito. Yan, tanglad din yan. Ang dami kong tanglad. Ang bulaklak ko, oh. ang, ang laki na. Super ganda siya. So, this one here, kukuha na naman tayo ng talbos ng kamuti. Ito naman, parang gusto kong antayin kasi maliit pa yung iba. Pero ang iba naman, malaki na. So, pwede na siya. Ay, ito naman, maliit pa, oh. Pwede kong kunin lang yung dahon niya muna. Ay, may ladybug. Look at the ladybug. Yan ang magpaprotekta ng halaman mo. Kinakain niya yung mga ipids. Pag mayroon, wala naman. Pero it's nice. It's, I feel lucky when the ladybug is there. So, ang gawin ko, kukunin ko tong dahon. Ganyan lang siya. Kunin ko yung dahon niya. Kasi lumalapit pa yung iba. Ayaw ko namang kunin. So, kukunin ko lang yung dahon niya. Kasi ganyan lang. Yan naman ang kailangan mo talaga. Eh. Yung dahon. Kasi bushing-bushy na siya. Ay, ay, ay. Ang sarap ng talbos ng kamote. Alam mo guys, go do this para makarami din kayo sa loob ng bahay o sa labas ng bahay. Ayan, ang dami na ng talbos ko. Ang dami na talaga niya. Kaya kukunin ko lang yung talbos niya para mag-grow pa yung maliligit. Ayaw ko namang putulin siya kasi ano pa siya, maliliit, katulad nito maliit pa o, lalaki pa yung dahon kasi niyan eh, kaya kunin ko lang yung dahon so it's gonna be good huh? I like talbos ng kamote kasi maggulay ako ngayon with shrimp I'm going to vlog that too just a simple making gulay, whatever you have available at home 
So that's what I'm gonna make today. With talong, with uh, alubati, na galing din sa loob ng bahay ko. Ibablog ko rin yun na tinukuha ko yung alubati. Ay, ang dami talaga niya. Super. Saka nandoon yung talong ko. Ang ganda na ng talong ko. Napakabushy na niya talaga. Oh. Nandoon, namumunga na yung talong ko. Nine, ano yan? Awalo. Ata, nakalimutan ko na naman. Ayan, kunan ko uli ito. Ayan. Inupaw ko na. Pero at least, dadami naman siya. Kasi pag kukunin mo yung dahon niya, it's not gonna die. Nagaano lang yan siya. It's gonna grow some more. Ayan. Nag-harvest na talaga ako ha. Iupawin ko siya. Iupawin. <laughs> Kasi dadami pa naman to eh. Sa kunin ko lang yung hindi pa ano masyado. Hindi pa siya malaki. I mean yung malaki na pala. Sorry. Yung hindi maliit masyado. Kasi mag-grow pa eh. Ay, ang lambot talaga niyang kunin. That means, napaka-fresh niya. Ay, napaka-fresh talaga niya. Ang lambot kunin. Kaya, ganyan lang siya. Inupaw ko. Ayun. <laughs> And then, you have your own potato. It's gonna be nice and yummy. Ay, sana hindi na ano si Ladybug. Nandyan lang nakita ko. Ayan. Ang sarap niya. Ang dami na. Tama na itong talbos ng kamuti na na-harvest ko. Tsaka ngayon, harvestin ko naman yung ano, harvestin ko na naman yung uh, alugbati. Pala ako ng tanglat eh, na ilalagay ko sa soup kasi masarap yung amoy niya. Ayan. Ganyan lang ako magkukuha ng tanglat. Hindi naman siya wild kasi tinanim ko lang siya. Kasi tingnan mo yung tanglat. Kunti lang kailangan ko. Kasi nandiyo na yung flavor ka agad. Yung matataas lang kinukuha ko. Ayan o. Oh. Ayan ay, ay ang bangko ng tanglat. Ayan lang. Wala yung chemical natin. Kaya ayun. Ayan na. Gulay na. Pagkain na. At saka yung alugbati. Ano yung ko rin? Harvesting ko ngayon. Isang alugbati ko sa another window. Kaya harvesting ko siya ngayon. Ayan. Ayan. Inharvest ko ha. Ayan. Danan, can you get me a plate please? Ayan. Marami na siyang inog na na lang yan. Ito naman, hindi ko, hindi na tumataas siya masyado kasi binutol ko. Just put it right here. Harvesting na. I have more big ones. Hirap lang ano yun kasi malaki na. Ayan siya. Ayan. Ayan. Ito namang aso ko. Ha? Nagaano para ba siyang pagdudahin? Kasi takbo kasi nung takbo kanina doon sa labas. Ayan o. Nakabis na yun. Ayan o. Ayan o. Ayan o. Maraming alubatin. Pag may tinanin, may ani. Kaya yun ang nangyari sa akin. May inaani ako. Ganyan lang sa'yo. Wala din sila minsan nito. Kung mayroon man, ang napakamahal ng buy pound. So, that's uh, parang $6 a pound almost. That's $5.99 a pound or $4.99 a pound. Napakamahal talaga. Mahal na yan eh. Kasi marami ka ng isda mabili niyan. Ano? Or, or meat or something. But gulay itself is so expensive. Ayan na. Tama na yan. May isa pa akong kukunan doon. That... Tatlo kasi ang ano ko, alog, alog bati. Ayan. Ayan, ito naman ang susunod kong harvestin. Sa kabila, ito yung na-harvest ko sa kabila, sa isang puno ko. Ito naman, yung another, ay ang laki nitong isang. Ayan, ito na siya. Ayan, at saka ito. gawa ko pa ganyan na siya kataas iniikot ko lang siya iniikot ko rin ko yan dyan, dyan. para palagi siyang nang, nang dadahan katulad nito ngayon ang daon siya ako po ng kasi magulay ako ng super sarap ni 
ito kasi napaka-organic kasi nakikita mo paano at saka walang bugs oh my goodness, that's important no bugs Iba namang yung vlog ko sa backyard dito kasi ang dami ko rin halaman doon na iba vlog. this today just for that okay and then this one ayan oh ito yung spinach na wild na nakuha ko today binigay ng kaibigan namin okay ito yung iba na spinach yung wild na spinach ito ang pinakamasarap sa spinach igagawa kong sabaw yan so nandito na yung tanglad okay andyan pa yung lagyan ko siya ng kalabasa at kukul sa talbos ng kamote na hindi ko pa inialis at itinanim kasi nag-experiment ako na gaano ko katagal siya maiwan na ganyan na hindi ipaplant. So, ayan ang lalaki na ng mga dahon. Pwede ko nang harvestin din eh. Pero ayaw ko muna kasi baka mamatay. Eh. Pwede ko siguro siyang harvestin. We'll see. Ayan. I washed the alubati, the Chinese spinach, and I already soaked that with water vinegar. This one here, a distilled white vinegar to clean the vegetable. Get the impurity out of it, okay? And this one I already washed that too. I washed that even, it's organic that I plant in the outside though. So you never know what's in it. So I wash them and soak them with water mixed with white a uh, distilled white vinegar also so it's super clean and this is to the alopati and then going back to the same so okay yan itong kalabasa this is the pumpkin squash from it's like Philippine squash it's like see I cut that and I have to bring the seeds inside and all the vegetables right there and wash also the same time gagawa din ako ng okoy ang bukas kasi marami ito isang buo na pumpkin or squash kalabasa okay welcome to happy happy meal vlog tv this is a full uh, sangkap na gulay na lulutuin ko this one is talbos ng kamote from my garden. I blocked that already and it's gonna come out uh, after I edit that and put it all together. 
And this is the Alobati Chinese spinach indoor. And some of these are just, oh no, all of these are organic. And then opo. Opo na, ano ba tawag nyan sa ating opo? I don't know in English, I forgot about it. And this one is the wild spinach. Super yummy! Oh my god, this is the wild spinach. They call that like yung kasi iba yung dahon niya, oh. See, the spinach usually just round, right? But this one is different. Talong, kalabasa, and my grown, my very own grown uh, tanglad or uh, lemongrass. And then, with talong and shallots and onions. And this one is mixture with um, shredded shrimp. This one is shredded shrimp flavor. Like, see, it's like that. Shredded shrimp. It's like dried shredded shrimp flavor and then garlic paste and a lot of shrimp, the giant and jumbo shrimp. So this one is a really good flavor in shrimp. This is the pink, you know, the pink round shrimp that you can buy. It's very expensive really, but um, I buy like two pounds at a time. And then this one here is the jumbo shrimp and this one is the super extra large of course. I took the skin because I, when I eat vegetable, I just don't want to sh unshell them, you know. So I'm gonna cook here in my EOC, my um, electric oil for uh, Salad Master. I put it in 325 degrees. So I'm gonna put this all together. And this is some of the seasoning I Oh, this one here, the shrimp paste. A little bit only, like a half teaspoon. And then uh, cut this, uh, this sauce. And then onion powder and garlic powder just to you know to add up for the flavor and then some water it's like two, two, two and a half cups or three cups in here that's the water uh, filtered water of course okay from our fridge so okay now we're gonna start by sauteing something so let me put that away for now the lid so of course you don't have to put oil, but I'm gonna help it with the olive oil. It's a little bit healthier. Oil is oil, but you know, when you put olive oil or avocado oil, and I'm putting, I'm putting that shallots in. More stronger. Let me put my pan. There you go. Let me put that first. me out. <laughs> I'm just gonna saute just a little. You don't want to cook them totally because I just want to bring out the flavor. Okay, just slow sauteing them. Then I'm putting the even cakes in a I'm just sauteing them. Okay, saute, saute lang siya. I'm putting the, uh, the uh, garlic paste. Simple lang siya, pero pinakamasarap na gulay talaga. Mostly here is organic. Except the talong. I'm not sure if it's organic because I just bought it from the store at each one. A Korean store. I tried to find here because my organic eggplant is not big enough to harvest yet. Yung tanim ko sa laban. Di pa siya ready. Okay? And what I do with that, I'm going to saute it with shrimp. Then after sauteing the shrimp, I'll take it out and put water. Just, I'm just gonna cook that just a little bit. Okay. Usually we put it all together with, excuse me, together with the vegetable, right? But me, I'm going to saute them first. And then you add that later. It comes out really good, guys. You're just copying what I did here and it comes out the same in your side. Okay? Feel ko lang na shrimp. Ang gawin ko, 
dapat ito is nilaw o yan yan eh na walang meat or anything just about with vegetable but this one I put a shrimp shredded shrimp dry shredded shrimp and then I'm gonna put a little bit of chili powder so a little bit spicy soup so I'm just gonna do that sauteing it I'm not gonna cook it totally, I'm just gonna saute it together with the garlic. And you put a little bit of seasoning that you mix. Mix, 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 mix. What I do is just, that's where the shrimp, uh, shredded shrimp there. Just to flavor your, the rest, you're gonna put that with all the vegetable together later. Okay? Just very simple, it's all homemade. Because I don't want the shrimp to be overcooked. That's why I have to saute it first and then, you know, leave all the shallots and everything except the shrimp. I'm going to put that back, the shrimp. Okay, just saute just a little bit. Okay, and then later when all the vegetable halfway done, then you're gonna add that. And so, na saute ko na siya ng mga 3 minutes. So, tanggalin ko siya para hindi ma-overcook yung shrimp. You don't want it overcooked, okay? So, I'm just gonna take it out before I put in all the vegetables. I just want yummy soup. You can even put gata with everything, but I just want it fresh. Uh, just soup and no gata, okay? And the next day, you can even put gata, you know? If I feel like gata, even the next day, all done and everything, what you do is you cook the coconut milk first so that it doesn't overcook your vegetable. You're gonna, you know, bring it to the simmer, your, your gata, the coconut milk, and then what you do is cook put your vegetable right now. So that would be, I do the same like that too. So now, it's like that, right? So now you're gonna put the water. Kasi gusto ko nang mahigup na sabaw. Kasi mag-water dito sa salad master namin. Maano lang yan eh. Mag-create ng water sa vegetable mo. Kasi they already they have their own water. Okay, natural water. But the thing is, I want more sabaw. So, you know, that's okay. So, yan na yung may flavor na siya dyan. At saka ilagay mo na yung flavor mo na ginawa na whatever flavor you like I put some garlic powder in there because I have my onion powder too I love everything with onion powder and garlic I like the flavor okay. that's the onion powder see onion powder and a little bit more of garlic powder Patis sauce, patis, fish, fish sauce, okay. Uh, two tablespoons. I love this. Hindi naman siya maalap na siya, so it's not 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 but I'm putting my uh, my lemongrass first. Ay, so, na ano yung tobe na spray sa gilid. Ayan. Ayan sa gilid. Okay. That's 325 degrees. Now, I wanna change that to 400 degrees for a quicker and faster cooking time. Yes, it's a um, 450 degree now. And I'll put the lid for just 5 minutes, okay? Pero hindi pa naman, nag-preheat pa yan siya. So it's gonna be a little bit, so. But that's what it is. Quick time. Just wipe the side. Ayan. Here we go. Ilalagay ko na yung lid. Yeah, he 
natin. Antayin na lang natin ng 5 minutes. Here I add the upo, okay? Kasi matigas siya, madali, hindi siya madaling maluto. Pero yung kalabasa niya, it's already halfway done, kaya maluluto din siya on time. Okay? Yan naman, balik na naman yan ng... Kasi ganyan lang pagluto ng if you don't want it to be overcooked, overcook, then you just do like that. Kasi itong ano... Madali lang siya minsan maluto. Eh, depende kasi din sa ano eh. Sa, sa, sa ano ba yan? Kalabasa. Pero itong kalabasa, minixture ko talaga siya na matigas pa siya. And still hard. So, it doesn't get mushy in there in between cooking. Okay? Okay. Then, susunod niyan is talong. Halfway on this. Okay? And I just put the eggplant at after halfway cooking the opo. Siya. Maliit ata yung lagyanan ko. Malaki na dapat niya. Ang dami ko kasi gulay na nilagay. And yeah, wala. And then I still got to put the vegetable here. See that? <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna fit all, but I'm gonna make it. Ayan. Kasi gusto ko pang sabaw niya. Ang ganda ng sabaw. Para may mahigo. May nakalakong ako. So I changed the pot. I'm gonna put that here because it doesn't fit all my vegetable that I make. I make some for my friend. It's her birthday yesterday and she wishes for a big ball, so I'm making it for her and me. Only me and her eat this stuff. It's our hobby and our kids doesn't eat this stuff. So, inilagay ko na yung shrimp dito para lagyan ko ulit siya ng tubig para iluto sa big ball. And then in the end, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this in here. I'm gonna, you know, put it together. Okay? Now, ayaw ko mang lutuin masyado yung shrimp kasi sinati ko na yan kanina. Okay, more water. I think I need to put a little bit more water here in my fridge. Okay, see, I got some water. Just maybe a half cup more. Okay. There. Para maraming sabaw na hihikupin yung kaibigan ko. Happy birthday to her. My friend Lorena. A nice lady, a nice friend. Wonderful friend. dadagdagan ko siya ng ng yung ano yung shrimp uh, shredded shrimp so, para flavor talaga na shrimp itong lulutuin okay so that one there it doesn't fit if I put all the vegetables so I end up putting this my big wok 7 quart my giant big uh, salad master wok there you go. That's my shrimp. Shredded shrimp. Maalat siya konti, but it's not really maalat. So now I'm putting the... I'm gonna put some chili. So that a little bit spicy. I like spicy. Para papawisan ka rin, right? Sa, sa anghang konti. Ayan. Yung ano. Mayroon din akong maanghang na soap. Pero hindi ko yun ilalagay. Kasi ayaw ko lang sobrang soap. Okay. Mantayin ko lang niya na mag-boil. Then, that would be almost done. Okay. After this, I just put the talbos na kamote. The mixture of my sauce on the soup I need with the shrimp. So, I'm going to go in there again. And then, I'll put the spinach after. And then, that's fully out at the end. Say, look, it's right. Once the heat up the boil, it will shrink. You don't want it to be really soft. Just enough softness to it. Just enough to cook. See? I'm gonna show you. Just like that. Super good. See the side of the shrink.
That's organic, super organic na. Oops, sorry. Tapos na kamot. I just add the spinach, the wild spinach. Kasi the pangkong is done na. So now it's the spinach is gonna be quick. Perfect. Manado ha, kasi gawgawa ako ng munggu bukas. Or maybe just put the whole thing. Sure. Put the whole thing. I have more anyway. In the... I'm supposed to make munggu for my hubby. He doesn't eat this stuff. Ayan. Tipan ko muna siya. Osog, osog. Ayan yung gulay, okay? I just want to make sure that it's sauteed there. Not sauteed, but it boiled just a bit. Not too cooked. Oh, I love all the organic vegetables. It's gonna make all that together with that later. I just don't want to overcook that because it's already halfway done. gonna wait a little bit and be right back guys super sarap tinikman ko yung sapaw napaka fresh at look at the vegetable it's not overcooked and the talgos ng kamote and the spinach look at all that so that's just exactly then I'm going to put this now together but this is so wonderful oh my goodness so yummy talaga for sure marami naman ako makain ito Ayan, tapos na yan. Kasi ayaw kong maluto na gusto. Ang ilagay ko ang okra pagkatapos. Kasi pasandalian lang yung okra only a minute and it's done. Kasi gusto ko ng crunchy na okra. Yan lang talaga ang pang ano. Imahag. Ano bang tawag yan eh. Ayan, ang okra kasi pag tantayin mo siya maluto ng matagal, if you cook this long time, the okra, it will get slimy. So that one is gonna cook only one minute. Then I put the lid on that. I can find the big lid. <laughs> I don't know. Oh on my uh, lid. Okay, takipan ko muna siya. At ito naman ang isusunod ko ilagay together. Kasi para may lasa ang ano niya, ang gulay. Talong, hindi din siya masyadong luto kasi malalata eh. I don't want lata in anything. Lata, bisaya. So just a moment for the okra. Just wait. Just a bit. Ayan na. Tanggalin ko na yung takip. Tapos na yung okra. Kahit crunchy siya, tapos na yan talaga. Only a minute I cook the okra. You don't want it to be so super crunchy and so that is good. Now I'm gonna put that but I need to both use both my hand, okay? Here it is guys, all together. I got that out from there and put it all together. Super sarap yung sabaw. Oh my god guys, I hope I can share again with you. So, ayan yung sabaw. Pwede siyang gataan or just the way it is. Kasi masarap na siya talaga. So, maraming greens. Ang dami niyang spinach. Na, na frisco pa yung spinach. Ayan, oh. Hindi siya lata. Right? You see that? Yan ang masarap. Ayan yung tangkos ng kamuti. Na I grow it only almost two weeks. And they have a lot of tangkos. Ayan. Ayaw kong sahugin ang sahugin. Karawin ng karawin, sabi pa ni Tita Binbin at Papa Joseph. Ayan. Ayan, oh. Tikman yung sabaw ha, tikman ko. Ayan.